One of the ways that we can show our understanding of set theory is to use Venn diagrams. So we're going to start with a Venn diagram based on the universal set D, all digits. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to draw a large rectangle. So the large rectangle is going to represent your universal set. So in this case, our universal set is set D, all digits. So all digits should fall within this universal set, within this large rectangle. Then within our large rectangle, we have our subsets. So E is a subset of D. All those even digits fall within the large rectangle because all of our even digits fall within the universal set of digits. So our numbers that would take that would fall into our subset E would be 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. Those are all our even digits, so they would all fall within the circle that represents the set of even digits. Now, our E prime, or the complement of E, are our non-even values. So our non-even values are going to be the leftover digits once our even values have been removed. So we are left with 1, 3, 5, 7, and 9. Now you'll notice that the N is outside of the rectangle that represents our universal set D, and this is because N does not exist as a subset of D. N is an empty set, so it would fall outside of our universal set of digits, D. Okay. 